yo hello everybody and welcome to the channel so this video is going to be a short video showing you a quick way to unlock the new uh or like Geralt of Rivia the Witcher skin which is this right here it's finally available actually the first part of the skin is available the second part is still uh, a secret or is delayed by two weeks so as you can see this one actually three weeks this one is going to be released in three weeks and it's basically going to be a uh, new variants for the uh for the skin it should be new variants but if you want to unlock the main skin the pickaxe the uh the emote itself the spray the back blink and the loaded screen all you have to do is just complete these quests right here which are absolutely simple so as you can see it says Geralt of Rivia and you just need to complete these uh five quests right over here so the first one is very very simple all you have to do is just activate augments in different matches you just have to play five matches so just jump into a match and two minutes into every match you will be presented with an augment choice and all you have to do is just choose one of the augments and activate them you can activate them by pressing uh, seven on your keyboard or if you're playing on console just go and see what the key byte is for your console uh you go right here you go to settings and then you go to console i think it's this right here right yeah. oh this one so as you can see it should say uh where the uh where the uh activate augment is one i think it was right here the up button maybe yeah there we go so it's emote select augments the down button so you can just change it from here if you don't have it so yeah just do that so that's for the uh the first quest second quest is to complete bounties just go to any of the bounty boards uh, presented on the map there's one at breakwater bay one at the citadel two right here next to shadow slabs one at Amber square so on and so forth just go activate the bounty and just make sure to complete it i think if, if any if somebody kills your bounty it also counts but just to be safe try to chase down your bounty and kill them yourself next one is to defeat a boss there's only one boss in the game right now it's the ageless champion and you can find him right here in the citadel it's not he's not easy to uh to kill <laughs> especially if there's a lot of people around you trying to kill him as well so try to go for the last shot to defeat him next one is to emote at the citadel room this one can be, can also be done at the same location so let's go go right over here and just jump down and you'll find a throne room and all you have to do is just emote there it's as simple as that and then you need to deal melee damage to opponents so this one can be done with two uh with two weapons either your main pickaxe basically just uh either go afk when the battle bus starts just go afk and then at the end of the battle pass there's always like a couple of people who are afk just you know float down with them until you hit the water and then you can just pickaxe them while they're in the water defenseless uh, or the other option is to grab a um a uh, hammer the shockwave hammer you can find the shockwave hammer in um in the oathbound chests there's a bunch of oathbound chests all around there's uh ones at shadow slabs right here ones at Cid the citadel i believe there's three at the citadel two over here two other over here they kind of like spawn in and out so you can just go ahead and just open those and you'll find the hammer uh also if you can uh, if you can defeat the boss uh, the boss uh the Aegis champion you can get the shockwave hammer from him as well i made a video on all the um oathbound chests like all their locations in, in the map if you want to go check that out you'll find it on the channel and yeah just open them or defeat the boss get the uh, get the pickaxe and then just keep uh hitting people with the hammer until he hit 500 damage and yeah, that's five. That's five quests. Just complete these five quests and you will automatically be granted the uh, the basic Geralt skin without any of the uh, like extra added styles. And yeah, that's pretty much it. This is the short video. <laughs> just just a quick one, just explaining everything. Uh, I'll be making a longer one with uh, with every quest like included. And of course, it will be timestamped and everything. So be on the lookout for that. If you're having trouble with any of the quests, you'll find that video and you can just use that as your uh, as your guide. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you found it helpful. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.